Bueno, bueno, comenzamos un nuevo juego en el canal y sí, esta vez con micro, <ríe> sorprendentemente. En este caso empezamos The Wolf Among Us de, de la empresa Telltale, famosa por, por hacer juego de, juegos de decisiones. Y no voy a hablar mucho más, la verdad. Eh, si escucháis un ruido de fondo es cosa del micro que, bueno, no es muy allá. Por suerte, mientras no hablo, el sonido del, del, del juego sube, así que ese ruido de fondo se, se bajará un poquito, un poquito, pero eso no significa que no, no desaparezca en todo el vídeo. Bueno, eh, para qué entretener más, ¿no? Voy a darle a jugar. Lo estoy jugando en PlayStation 4. Eh, la semana pasada salió, salieron unas ofertas bastante jugosas en, en la Store y la verdad es que lo aproveché y lo compré por 10 euros, que tenía muchas ganas de... De pasármelo de jugarlo. Y bueno, iniciamos el episodio 1. La verdad es que he oído hablar maravillas de este juego. Vamos a ver si... Este es el... Vale. Vamos a ver si de verdad... Cumple lo prometido, ¿no? A ver si... Si realmente... Me da eso que, 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 que espero, que es una buena historia, con decisiones. Vale. Today again, if you missed it, a record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now, and that humidity looks low. But remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. La verdad es que la gráfica es espectacular, ¿no? Así... Extraído del cómic de, de Fábula, si no lo conocéis, la, la historia en la que se cuenta aquí en este videojuego está extraída de, de los cómics de Fábulas. Fábula. Eh... Y nada, nos ponemos en la piel de... El lobo feroz. Un poco diferente, ¿no? A cómo se cuenta en... El cuento de Caprucita. Y la verdad es que es una maravilla estéticamente. Mr. Toad. Oh, shit. Big B. Listen, mate. I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. <laughs> I've heard enough of your excuses, Toad. This is unacceptable. Can't afford to look human. Going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place! So... What am I walking into exactly? A uh, woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. Oh! D 
This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. So what set him off? Who knows why it was this time? Man's got a hair trigger. I avoid him as much as possible. When did he start drinking? Not sure he ever stopped. Fuck you! I didn't know anyone else was up there. Frick job shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. <laughs> then get the fuck back inside! Vamos a investigar un poco. A ver qué es lo que sucede ahí. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey! Ah, los controles están bastante guays. Parece un poquito a... A los de Walking Dead, más esclavado prácticamente. Con mando. Take a look. Take a good look. Know who I am now? Hey, look at me. Get off of me. Parece que no hay nada más, ¿no? Bueno, pues vamos a entrar. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! hey. You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid <laughs> I'll fucking kill you! All right, everyone. <laughs> what are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. You're drunk, all right? Think this through. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. <laughs> this isn't last time. You gotta keep it down. Had enough? Está muy bien los que también ven. Es un fucking challenge. Se nota un poquito, ¿no? Que los subtítulos son Son latinos, pero bueno No le vamos a pedir buenos subtítulos a Telltale You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting sick, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. You bugged my jaw, you bastard. And still you talk. Fuck you. Shit. What the hell is going on? 
What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry, you saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off! Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you alright? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. Why was he hitting you? Maybe you should ask him that. I will, but I asked you first. I think this is a very promising beginning, right? We're not going to get anyone in the middle of it. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on me. Al cazador de, de I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of stones and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Come on. <laughs> Hey, Toad. My car. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. So, uh, how good is your insurance? I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well. At least you're not fucking dead. Y otra vez, este hombre no se cansa nunca, ¿o qué? I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more for me. He'll be. I'll kill you. You fucking bitch. Let me help you. Guy's <laughs> having a bad day. That makes two of us. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. Las fábulas son difíciles de matar. Bueno, decir que voy a grabar un capítulo por, es decir, una parte de YouTube por capítulo. Si, el, si no me equivoco son cinco capítulos de The Wolf Among Us, como la mayoría de los juegos de Telltale. Y veremos por dónde nos lleva la, la historia y, y, y mis decisiones. These lips are sealed. Sorry.
Hey, you like my ribbon? If you don't answer my questions, I can't help you. I'm answering them the best that I can. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Ya no está. Se fue. <laughs> Shit. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. He hit you. He needs to pay for that. He's got nothing to give, Sheriff. I checked. Besides, I just swung an axe into the guy's head. I'd say we're even. Maybe I should be arresting you. I'm not going to be doing this for much longer. So, now's your chance. How much was the owed you? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. I wish I could help. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I... You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Wow. Tell me what you really think. Hey. I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Le ha dado un beso. Qué bonita es. Wolf. Traducir Wolf a Ferro es un poco raro, ¿no? Quiero decir, pueden haberlo dejado original. Que Wolf queda guay. Pueden haber puesto Lobo. Podrían haber, yo qué sé, pero no. Le ponen Ferro. Me recuerda a un ferrocarril. Joder. Qué desagradable esa traducción. Bienvenido a Barrio de Fabra. Guay, 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 guay. No sé si silenciar el audio por eso del copyright y esas cosas. Yo creo que sí que lo voy a hacer. Ya lo vuelvo a poner. Vale, es que lo único que quiero es que... Lo último que quiero es que... No nos metan un strike en el canal. <risa> pues... Eh, ya lo vemos. Eh, es como un cómic jugable. Y se desarrolla a partir de nuestras decisiones y de nuestras elecciones. Eso lo hace muy, muy, muy suculento. Episodio 1. Fe. Y ahora voy a volver a meter el audio. La verdad es que voy a querer explorar todo el escenario. Luxury apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Estos juegos merecen ser vistos al detalle. Algunos creados por Big Como he dicho antes, el creador de 
el creador del cómic de Fabulous. Sometimes be a disciplinarian. Blanca. Ha introducido Snow White como Blanca. Bueno, tiene sentido, ¿no? Come on out. All right. All right. Beauty. Yes, baby. Hello, Big B. Big B Lupo. Uh, Primero Ferro y ahora Lupo. Pero qué 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 es esto? I know this looks a little odd. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, can't. I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and... Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. I don't have time to go into it right now. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. It's not what you might be thinking. A ver qué nos cuentan aquí dentro. Está sopa este hombre. Hey, you wank? Yo creo que no. Probably for the best. My catcher needs to dust this guy. Since I got any mail, seventh day in a row. Nadie le escribe al 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 pobre lobo. Big B. Damn thing fell off again. How much longer is this going to go on? Vamos a enseñar algo más por aquí. La verdad es que son unas cámaras fijas sobre raíles bastante interesantes. Quiere decir, siguen al personaje. Y te da una visión bastante amplia del, del escenario en sí. Están muy bien hechas. La verdad es que Telltale está haciendo un trabajo espectacular. Big B. Hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? I'm staying out of it. Out of what? Whatever it is, Beast. I'm not a marriage counselor. Damn it. Something's going on.
Y lo he dicho, Telltale está haciendo un trabajo espectacular. Está en, en todos los lados, vamos. Walking Dead va a hacer la Season 3, Juego de Tronos la Season 2. Quién sabe si The Wolf Among Us Season 2. Borderlands, tal vez. Tal vez la Season 2 también. Eh, Minecraft creo que ya está terminado, creo. Creo que... De Minecraft ya la han terminado también. Y ahora están funciones de, de distribuidora. Eh, con el juego este de Seven Days, no sé qué, que es de zombies. Tiene algún que otro proyecto más entre manos, por ejemplo el, el juego de Batman que sale este verano. Que sale este verano. Y que muy seguramente sea fiel al, a los cómics. A ver si consigo todas las entradas del libro de de fábulas del tirón. Got a smoke? Thanks. A couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Don't be a pain in the ass. I'll tell you what I told Toad. And what's that? I can't give you a free pass. Lectured by the big bad wolf. He must have loved that. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Nice. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well, I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would if you could. Probably. 
But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories, either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. Wasn't my fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. <laughs> you think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's in their That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, not everyone. Name one. Uh, I don't actually know her name. Awesome. Great example. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window and... I want to get in two seconds of shut-eye before I... Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Thanks, Big B. Curioso. Bueno, prosigamos. Ay, a ver, que las conversaciones y los diálogos son muy interesantes. Vamos a ver quién pica. Big B. Snow. Come with me. Snow. Snow! What? Sorry, I'm... What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. This girl is she's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? 
I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She looks familiar. Just a girl. We didn't have a whole lot of time to chat. Woodsman. He attacked her, I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Pobre, ¿qué le habrá pasado? Vamos a investigar. Parece que tiene algo en la boca. ¿no? What is? It's a ribbon. There's some kind of symbol here. Hmm. I, I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Vamos a mirar por aquí. Strange cut. Did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Sorry, this is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what, what do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. You should hurry. We don't have much time left. We should head back inside soon. Nobody there. Y solo nos queda la bifurcación esta de la derecha. Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Just some loose trash. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. I 
the garbage men can even find their way here. Yep, more blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, and left the trail I found earlier. Parece que ya sabemos más o menos el recorrido. Pero no sabemos nada acerca de quién lo pudo hacer. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? Why her? Someone brought her in from the outside. That makes sense. There's no signs of a struggle. But how do you know? Found blood on the fence back there. Someone hopped over. Okay, good. That's solid. So someone from the outside. Well, at least they didn't come from inside the woodlands. I'm gonna have to talk Crane about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. You can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. Y se pira. Y deja el cadáver ahí. <ríe> Pobrecita. What are you blind? Why you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I don't have time for this. Yeah, you and all the rest of them in there. Fucker. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon the sketch. Bueno, vamos a ver. Doorstep. The last thing I would make a call away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. Who else is to blame if not you? It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, is that how you see things? Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing certain yet. Well, find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. For my massage, in serio? Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. No puedo hacer nada bien, pero que cabrones. Do your job, Sheriff. 
Well, we'll find someone who can. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. <sighs> well, that. Aye. There's no siempre cuidando los dos. Maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. What an asshole. Yep. That was about an eight on the asshole scale. Asshole scale? Well, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> Is... Is he gone? Yes, thankfully. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, you get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. Not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. I really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. Try. Yes, I mean. I oh, have the record right here. Give me one more. Voy a antes a dar un rodeo y si no hay nada, ir al espejo. Well, that's not what I have here. Que I parece que no hay nada. No, no tienen. No tienen cortado. I'll be sure to let him know. Yes. Las buenas cajas de colisión. That's not a problem. Así que nada, vamos a ir al espejito, espejito mágico. Hey, magic mirror. I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel. But have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See? Was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. <laughs> There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Show me Buffkin. Hey! Put down the bottle and get to work! <laughs> Still looking! <laughs> Show me Snow White. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Show me Buffkin. Hey! 
Put down the bottle and get to work. Still looking! <laughs> Nobody right now. Very well. Please no lo el nombre, volveremos ask a... about someone else. Y le a... espejito mágico. De las fábulas. Ahí está. Qué mono es. <laughs> Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Vale, pues vamos para allí. A ver qué ha averiguado. La verdad es que es muy interesante el poniendo muy interesante ahora con la muerte de, de la chica esta que me imagino que se llama Faith porque el nombre del capítulo es Faith qué chulo el anillo great what I can't read any of this shit I can help Look out for each other. Don't overdo it. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairo. I'll go look it up. Alairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? Donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, <laughs> also known as. <laughs> Ass skin <laughs> ah, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, his daughter, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... Her name was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. Vale, vamos a... a mirar los libros antes. Terminar de mirarlos. Bufkin, translate. Hmm. An exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. We already know her name, but feel free to have a look if you like. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. My buddy. The woodsman? Yep. And his axe. And his white tip. And the two of them. I wonder what the story was. Beauty in happier days. Mm -hmm. 
Cuanto menos hablemos de ellos, mejor. East. Colin and his brothers. Yeah, that's her, all right. Long time ago. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. Nice hat. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. <laughs> Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Ahí está. Creo que ya lo ha mirado todo de por aquí. Sí, perfecto. Vale, voy al espejo. Ahora que ya sabemos que era por aquí. El nombre. Ahí está. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, Abel, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Show me... Show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing. It's simply the way this has to be. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. What's he been doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Sorry, I have to get that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I. He is. Hold on, Bigby. It's for you. Bigby, it's me, Toad. You there? Toad, got your glamour yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Bigby, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big Big, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toe's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. Vale, vamos allá. La cosa se pone aún más interesante, ¿no? Sobre el asesino de de Faith y ahora lo de lo del sapo. Vamos. Allá. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Pues, 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 pues. Como prima lo del asesinato. 
Yo creo que vamos a ir primero al, a ver al príncipe Lawrence. We need to tell him about his wife. He deserves to know. Porque and, and tell como han dicho había hacía mucho tiempo que no había un asesino por, for a few hours. por allí y, we'll y creo que es lo que prima así que vamos a ir a verlo. Creo que lo del sapo no no tenga no creo que tenga tanta importancia. Supongo que podrá esperar. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. We're here to question Lawrence. Bump him up on the suspect list, or cross him off entirely. Okay. What is it? I just... I just don't think he did it. In cases like these, isn't it usually the husband? For Mondays, maybe. But this is different. Lawrence, you in there? Hey, open up! It's Bigby. I need to talk to you. Hey. Hey. All right. We'll try this out. Guess we're out of options. Come on, help me up. figure out what the hell is going on here. Who would do this to them? I don't know, Snow. Bueno, pues otro muerto. Parece que lleva bastante tiempo así. Pues todo por, por cómo está la casa, por... Como está él, realmente <laughs> su correo perdía bastante tiempo. Así Sharp, bueno. there's blood on the blade. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? Still a little sticky. What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. That doesn't really help. Dry. 
on the grip and the trigger. It matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. Stand over there. Point towards Lawrence, as if you're the shooter. This is... feels strange. What are you thinking? The slug should have gone over there, right behind him. Not here. Right. So the shooter stood somewhere else. Maybe. Or we don't have the whole story. hacia abajo la bala y no hacia arriba I'll see you again. Love your devoted Lawrence. I should know his face. There are so few of us. I should know his face. Oh my god, Rigby, he's alive! What? What are you doing here? Get you back up. Oh, what are you doing here? What's going on? We found you here in your chair with what we thought was a fatal injury. We should call Swinehart, have him take a look at you. Wait a second on that snow. You know who I am? Yes. Good. I have a few questions. What? What? What's this about? What happened? I don't know. I... Oh, shit. I shot myself in the heart. Oh, fuck. You're hurts like fucking hell. Your heart's actually a little more to the center. Probably had a lung. Great. At least that's how I think it happened. Things are a little fuzzy. Thought it was a bad dream. Why did you do it, Lawrence? I did it because I was ashamed. I, I couldn't live with myself, knowing I had done that to her. I did what I could to keep her away. She comes by. Make sure I'm okay. I'm a fucking burden. I'm useless. I don't want her to have to worry about me anymore. She's better off without me. Without me being here to drag her down. She deserves that. She's been through a lot. I just wish I could have done better by her. She's always been there for me. Go away. Just fucking go away. You're 
wife is missing. What? Oh, no. 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 No, no, no. I knew this would happen. Fucking Georgie. Why whoever's out there is breaking in. I need your help. What do I do? Just play dead. What? Trust me. You can't move in your condition anyway, so just stay still. The second we figure out what they're here for, Bigby will arrest them. Think about your wife. Give me back the gun, just in case. Persecución de Scream. Ruye mientras me va tirando objetos por las escaleras. Inside here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why <coughs> did you run? What? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? You're looking for the woodsman, right? My employer is looking to ask him a few questions, too. Who's your employer? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. You almost looked peaceful. Bueno, joder. Vaya, usted me han pegado. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Well, the one guy hit you, then the other one started kicking you. Explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. 
Come on, get up. We should check in on Toad, see if there's anything there that can get us back on the trail. Vale, vale, vale. And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah, looks worse in the day. La verdad es que I don't... pobre pobre Big B, eh? se lleva todos los golpes. <laughs> we came all this way for nothing. All right, son. All right, he's gone. He's left. It's over now. Is that his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? Hey, Toad, you in there? Baby and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this Miss way. White. <laughs> Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. Are you sure there wasn't anyone here? Uh, not that I saw. <laughs> and if there was, they didn't take nothing. So, you know, all's well that ends. Qué extraño, ¿no? Algo estará ocultando. Is your son in there? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than walker, just like his dad. Es mejor nadador que caminante. So, I guess you'll be taken off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer you talk, the longer this takes, so just stand over there and shut up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. TJ, are you all right? There you are. I don't mean to intrude, but Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection, and I was wondering if you could perhaps let me see it? It has a weevil. Cool. <laughs> Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. This happened. Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh huh. The lamp just fell off the table. Well, the boy was faffing about, playing salts and salt fish. Who knows with the lad? Your lock's busted, too. This place is falling apart. Eh? Huh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, the fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. Vaya, parece que tiene explicación para todo y vamos, que algo ha sucedido y está está todo hecho un desastre. Pero bueno, a ver cómo lo demostramos, ¿no? Al fin y al cabo, lo importante. Aquí hay sangre. It's just some wood rot. Not mold or anything. You bleeding? Why? Is that it's blood? Still fresh. Oh, well, I cut me hand. Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Sounds painful. Oi! Don't you go mother ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Looks to be in a fable, I suppose. 
and a frog. There's more blood over here. On the poker? Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's... that's how it happened, didn't it? I was... I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. But like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna say something, out with it. You cut yourself? But didn't put the poker away after? Oh, I'm sorry, me housekeeping's not up to your standards. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? I mean, things happen, you know. This apartment's a goddamn mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. You're lying about something. But I'm not coming after you. It's gonna make it worse for you. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened, I... No, there's marks here on the windowsill. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night, when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Scared Junior off to death. The new uh, Shaken Stevens album yet? Okay, Sheriff. Now what? Junior was home. Why didn't he let you? It was the middle of the sodding night, Big B. I'm supposed to wake him because his jammy daddy didn't remember to check his pockets. There's a mark over here, too. What do you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Ah, oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, and now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you well, moved I did it. some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on, get off with this. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... the sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I call. Really, I am. But will you please... Please, just bugger off! Not yet. Not yet? No one fought anyone, Bigby. There wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody hell! It's not seemly! When? When I figure out what's going on here, Toad. You can help the process along, you know. How? How am I gonna help the process along? 
These stories have made no sense. You didn't forget your keys. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, dumb or dee. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman ain't. Bueno, era, era un poco de esperar, ¿no? Después del ataque que nos hicieron a nosotros. Bueno, a lot of us are. We're sorry, TJ. Really. We were lucky it didn't go any further. What was he looking for? I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or well, Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? I don't know, though. The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes. Borrows? I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. If my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. What do you want to do with it? Don't make it a dilemma. I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. But maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. And don't worry about what happened earlier. Just feel better, okay? And if you're looking for the woodsman, try down at the trip trap. Pobrecito, ¿no? Pues eso, les atacaron a medianoche y... Y únicamente quería proteger a su hijo y tal. Does it always go that smoothly? Not often. So, split a cab? Sure. I can only go to the trip trap for now anyway. Not because of what Toad said. Hopefully the woodsman's there. Or, I don't know. Someone who will know where to find him. It's my best lead. Our only lead, really. When you put it that way. Ahí, Manny con la sala. Ojalá y pueda conseguir el platino de este juegazo. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like. We're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. 
Getting some answers out of them will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby? Be honest with me. Who do you think... did this? I know it's still early, but... I just feel a step behind. It's an uncomfortable feeling. The guy... I mean guys who attacked me, D and Dumb, they've got something to do with all this. You think so? I don't know how or why just yet, but if you're asking... Hmm, it's a hunch. Hombre, estaban en los dos lugares, quiero decir. Muchísima casualidad debe ser, ¿no? Que uno entre en la casa del príncipe Lawrence y aparte también ataquen a... al sapo. Thanks I wish you. there was. Seguro que, bueno, vamos a disfrutar de este momento que es muy bonito. Sorry. I was just going to say thanks for the help. It's been appreciated. That's all. Of course. I'm just glad I haven't been in the way. Far from it. So. It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the Woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be, but Crane runs things his own way. You're doing your best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, Pobre. as he puts it, wasting his time. You'll fix it. Qué imágenes tan bonitas deja el juego, eh. System. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard. We have all. Están dibujado. You try and come in through the front door. Los viñetas y los cómics. Asking for anything help. Well, estéticamente es. Turn you away. Una maravilla. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You should stick it out. There are fables that would give up a lot to be in the position you're in, and I think it's easier to change something from the inside. You're telling me change comes from within. Uh, sure. Not the advice I imagined hearing from you. I'm full of surprises. I used that one. Maybe you should handle this one. Yeah. Maybe I should. Big B. I... Just be careful. Please. Same goes for you. I will. I will. Vale, pues vamos a a ver qué encontramos dentro.
What do you want, Sheriff? I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. So I guess you can go now. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just wanna know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nuts. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. Mía, como mienten. <laughs> but yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. Does he tell you when to close, too? Nope. And he doesn't tell me when to tell you to fuck off. Vamos a investigar todo. Como siempre. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. A word's getting out. Whose is that? Someone who left. Why didn't you dump it? If you want a cleaner place, feel free to get the fuck out of here. I'm sensing a very hostile tone from you. Don't deny it. I'm good at picking up on this stuff. Regular? I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Never seen him. Got any change for this thing? No. Hold it, get going, Let me solve the mystery for you. They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. You guys playing right now? Nah. A lot of stools in this place. If I sit over there, I'm gonna have to yell to talk to you. And I don't like raising my voice. Unless I really have to. You're gonna order something? Or you just here to bother my customers? <laughs> you know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a lime? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. It was all right. This is fun. This back and forth. We should really do it more often. But, uh, I'm starting to lose my patience. Ah, 
Ollie, you're out of paper towels and... Uh... El pobre que va también cosido de heridas hasta arriba. Just gonna sit down without saying hello. You and me been going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. I just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Okay, Greg. Funny. Just no parece que vaya a acabar muy bien. One seemed to know who you are. Conversación, ¿no? No. Everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> no, I'm the bad guy and you're sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Come on, Woody. You know why I'm here. You want to know what happened. Amongst other things, sure. <coughs> Funny. The shit you're willing to do for money. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. She wouldn't put up any kind of fight. <laughs> I was gonna rob her. And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. I wasn't there to save her. What are you talking about exactly? Red Riding Hood? Her grandmother? I was there to rob him. <laughs> When I showed up, you were already there. Lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Not a good that did. Did you kill Faith? What? Faith? Who's that? The girl you were beaten on this morning. No, 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 no. I, I was here. I swear. It doesn't look good when a girl you were just smacking around shows up dead hours later. She's dead? Big, big listen, I... I'm a piece of shit, okay? I know that. I hit that girl. I did. I, I shouldn't have, but I didn't kill her. You believe me, right? They're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. He was here. That's the fucking truth, Sheriff. You see? Bigby, please. You can't. They'll throw me down the witching well, that's what they'll do. And I didn't do it. You know that. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. And they come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? Lapdog? Really? Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. I wouldn't call her that. It's happened before, and it doesn't end well. I didn't realize you were the bitch of the bitch. <laughs> that all you got? Seem to be enough. Don't be so sure. Oh. 
Scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. Hey, eso es trampa. Joder, qué paliza me está Interesante, parece que ya se ha transformado. Bueno, vamos a dejarle que nos plan de continuar con esto. Creo que ya tenía suficiente. Y como sheriff habrá que dar un poco de gente. Whisky. This never happened. I'm good. Don't even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? Hey, he started it. You hit him first! Yeah, but he was being an asshole. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck. Interesante. It's not necessary. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. Genial. Do 
anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. We had something very special. Pero no puede ser. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Where's the rest of her? Serial killer. Oh. Oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us? Wait, the woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks for not saying anything. Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punish someone. We can arrange that. Oh, what did you do? Friend on friend, at the end of the end. Jesus Christ, big baby. Is that you? Episodio 2. Qué buena pinta tiene. Bueno, pues... <risa> Estoy el kit, tengo básico, por eso se quedaron con el dinero Pues eh, con esto vamos a terminar el, el capítulo eh, Como ya he dicho, un, un, una parte por capítulo Y bueno, eh, aquí hasta aquí todo Espero que os haya gustado Y eso, nos vemos en el siguiente, en el siguiente episodio Hasta otra <risa>